Yaakov Obi supporters believe now that Igbos belongs to the Yorubas, MC Olomo. I don't even know who is dragging Lagos with these people. You see, what these people are doing is just to cause ethnic crisis, which is really very wrong. Igbos are now being victimized in, in Lagos because Peter will be one in Lagos. This is wrong. Peter will be project is not an Igbo project. Peter will be Peter will be proje project is called movement. Every St. Nigerian St. Peter will be as the only credible candidate. But no, those who think that power belongs to them said no. Now, coming back to the threats and all that. After you don't threaten people, may they not come out. They go use their eyes, see paper, give them come out. Because of power. This thing you people are doing right now, this, people, this thing you people did do now, tomorrow you go rip up. Because you have, this, you, you have succeeded in causing division between the Yorubas and the Igbos. Because of your selfish interest. Igbos are not dragging Lagos with anybody. I don't think so. You know, say so if you talk now, then go say, hey, you are supporting the Igbos. You are supporting Peter Obi. Person not even know what you go talk again. This is really very wrong. And because Peter Obi won in Lagos, now Igbos are now to be dealt with. Okay, make we take on like this. Is it only Igbos that is found in Lagos State? If now only Igbos voted for Peter Obi in Lagos, do you think Peter Obi will win the election? Okay, tell me how people when come stay for that place, will come plenty pass on our when get the land. When we say na then come make the election, come make Peter Obi win election. This is what they call politics of hatred. And this will not take anybody anywhere. Una they do politics do and die. Politics is supposed to be a game. If you win, good. If you lose, no problem. Come back again. It's a game of chances. If he enter for you, thank God. If he not see enter for you, come back. Una they keep people. Una they do whatever, everything possible to make sure say una they power. But don't forget that God is alive. Anyway, guys, Nigerians have reacted angrily to this so. But let's quickly hit the news and get the full, the full details. But before then, if you are just joining us, please kindly subscribe to this channel and don't forget to give us a thumbs up. I hope OB supporters believe now that Lagos belongs to the Yorubas, MC Ulomo, a Lagos branch chairman of National Union of Road Transport Workers. MC Ulombo has called out obedience after the governorship elections in Lagos. Taking to his Instagram handle after the election, he wrote, I hope the Obi supporters believe now that Lagos belongs to the Yoruba and they are facing the consequences of Lagos being no man's land. The end of such bad treatment is in the, the sight by the help of Yahweh's intervention. One day, one day, I have a dream that the Igbo man will be literally, will be rich, rich, literally begged to handle the affairs of this country, and Igbos will be willingly to say no to the bad treatment and stereotyping. God save Nigeria. Turning election into tribal war. You should just not, you should note that. We Igbos are not in any way dragging who gets Lagos. Mind, mind him that every December we do travel back home. So Lagos is never Igbo home. All what we demanded and needed is a good governance that we benefit everyone irrespective of your tribe, landlord or tenant. Besha, no only time we tell we only time we tell we know when tribe will cry less or more okay 
I can't really get that. Sorry about that. These are reactions by Nigerians. There is no law in this country. In the same society, people like MC Uloma will be, will be behind the bars. Exactly. We now know who owns the land. This not be play. For your mind, mind it you are stealing with guns and all types of weapons. It means you don't trust yourself. Tia, can you speak common pigeon, let alone English? Those who are hailing him now, we have the courts to regret later. The not forever grown latrin. Tinubu takes power. We are switching how it will unfold. Every December, it was travel back home. That should tell you that we are not dragging the ownership of Lagos with you. But it did not ring a bell. It succeeded in escalating a tribal war all in the name of politics with just a look on The end will justify the means everyone will give account of his life one day. Very soon, enemies will come. If only people were allowed to exercise their voting rights, you wouldn't be here saying this. Don't worry, time will tell. You must pay for that you and your family members have done. It does not understand the contents of discussion. It is not about Igbo or only other or any other tribe, but about the masses and their leader. God bless Lagos State. I don't live there anyway. I hope if Tinubu become president, you will come to Abuja. We are waiting for you in Abuja. Yoruba Nation is the answer. Shebi na Igbo, you hate. I will now see who you will hate in Lagos then. Omobori, too wrong cannot be right. But time will tell, I promise you. Omo Agbero, Omo you go see pepe okay guys these are reactions by nigerians as you can see nigerians are not happy with the attitude of this very man mc olomo